in this chamber on the 17th of January, the First Minister said the Salmond Inquiries will be able to request whatever material they want, and I undertake today that we will provide whatever material they request. Will the presiding officer ask the First Minister to explain why she lied to Parliament? Well, I recognise the point of order. First of all, before I address that, can I just suggest to Ms Mundell that using words like lie is not appropriate in this chamber. Uh, Mr Mundell can perfectly find the language to express his concern without using lang language like that. I'd ask him to consider that point. If he would uh, apologise for using the term liar in the chamber or lied in the chamber. Um, I apologise to you personally, presiding officer, but in this case I do feel it's the appropriate word <laughs> and I can't find anything else uh, that would express the sentiment. Mr Mundell, that's not an apology. Uh, it, do you want to rephrase that, please? I, I, I just don't think, I don't think it's very fitting of Mr Mundell. It doesn't reflect Mr Mundell's character, and I'm sure he's perfectly capable of finding language that expresses his view about the accuracy of comments without uh, personalising and making pejorative terms, and, which are disrespectful to other members. I, with due respect, presiding officer, I think it's disrespectful to the Parliament for the, presiding, uh, for the First Minister uh, to make a promise and not to keep it. Uh, but I, I, so I, I can't withdraw the word, no. Okay, well, I, I think Mr Mundell has made his point. I'm afraid, Mr Mundell, I have to ask you to leave the chamber. I, I don't think that language is acceptable. Thank you.